hello guys today i will tell you how to plot by using the origin software so this is the origin software window now i will drag my file this is my file i will drag it to origin you can just drag and drop yeah so here you can see uh, you can remove this space this is unit in so we will put place the unit here and we can delete it you just copy it and right click it and you can delete it so now this is your data okay so this is your let's just turn it I don't know why what is the problem so here we will put the log name a okay so this is this is your data now if you want to plot it you can directly select it and press shift and you can select it like this or you can select it like this okay now you want to plot it just go to the plot and you can take any line symbol okay uh, line plus symbol pi bar depends on it depends on you what do you want to do so we will do only line so this is your ftir spectra of, of the sample file which i i was having now so now we will make it as per the general requirement uh, because the ftir and uh, xrd and xps all these are used for the publication purpose so we will make it so now just select this line and double click on it so you can see this window layer organization will be open now if you want to change the range you want to change this range you can change so it is starting from 250 we don't need it so we will start it from 500 and it is ending at 4500 so we will make it 4000 whatever range you want to uh, want you can change so we will apply it okay if you want to change it more so we can make make it 700 also okay and apply it similarly uh, for y axis we can do the same so it is starting from 72 so that looks okay and ending at 88 so that is also uh, we can make it 88 okay and apply it now you can see these are the minor uh, ticks outside so if you the here you can see minor ticks if you make it zero you can make it zero okay like this minor tick so here you can see I have selected the y-axis that's why the minor tick has gone similarly we will do select an x-axis and make it minor tick will gone now now just go time and title and format so this is your title and format so this is bottom this is top so we will select the top and we will tick this here so axis and ticks and it is showing out so we will play make it none we don't want any out uh, outside ticks so apply it see this line came similarly we will do for the right one here none none so just apply it so this is your graph okay if you want to change this range you can change by here this okay a scale go to scale you want to change you can change okay like this you can do now yes now we want to change the color of it so we can change the color of it here you can see this is black color so you can take any color suppose red color for genders we are giving sending very small pictures so it's better to change the width of the lines and apply it now see your image looks better if you want to change suppose this is a, a 2d material so we will place it 2d material okay and we can just click on it and we can place anywhere 
okay it depends on you and your general requirement similarly if you want to change the uh, x-axis value okay so you can change you can write wave number okay wave number in centimeter okay you can select it minus one and you can change it from right like this similarly you can do it for here you can write trans mittens because it is it is a FTIR is extra okay so we will write it AU A dot U auxiliary units we can call it okay so this is your figure okay this is the figure you want to change the font of it you can change from here you can make it uh, the word style you can change you can change the font similarly you can do for here do the here you can change for this also if you want to change the x axis scale so you can change like this it's better to change it because for genders you will print this image in a very small size so it's better these values will be bigger and everybody can see so this is how you can plot using origin software for your paper publication purpose so if you like my video please like and subscribe thank you